wild caught Alaskan sockeye salmon. <laughs> some backyard salmon smoking going. Hey folks, uh, back to gardening, we're cooking, smoking that salmon. That's it folks, that's smoked salmon. Oh baby, look at that. We'll catch you uh, with the next project. The dough making, um, it starts off with uh, one cup, two cups of spring water. This Go for 15 minutes. And we'll do a little uh, mix of the flour and the spring water and the sugar and the yeast. And again, this is just the first step in this process. This is only one cup out of the five cups of flour that will eventually make up the uh, bat. step in the um, dough making process and we decided we're going to make some uh, bagels to go with the smoked salmon that will make the most sense so yeah this is the mixture okay um, so yeah we added four more cups of flour um, so that's five total five cups of flour, two cups of water, one teaspoon of yeast, um, two tablespoons of sugar. Uh, oh, we do want to add some salt. We're just gonna mix it up.
can get messy. Um, and uh, so, but I hope you're not thinking like we're gonna just totally hand mix this, cause uh, no. <laughs> We're gonna run this in. We're actually just gonna run this here for like a minute and get it mixed up and then we're gonna let it rest. And let it rest for 10 or 15 minutes and then come back and run it again for four or five minutes and then pull it out and then we're gonna do a little hand kneading. But uh, let's just uh, start her up, let her run for a minute and uh, see what happens. Okay, that was about a minute and um, and we're going to just let it rest. Let it rest uh, maybe you know, 10 or 15 minutes, then we'll come back and we'll kick it back on to second gear and um, for about four or five minutes. Like I said, that's good for uh, six pizzas or eight bagels or eight pretzels, something like that. Um, but we'll cover this. We'll cover this with a little um, press around wrap, whatever. Let it sit here and uh, give her about an hour or two to kind of rise up and get nice. stopped at uh, Walgreens and picked up a, a little uh, uh, Christmas present for Granny. Don't tell Granny. And uh, it just came a little late. But um, I haven't even opened it yet to see it. Uh, just don't tell Granny that we already opened it. Hey folks, uh, welcome back. Gardner here. We're going to do some fresh Blueberry scones. You didn't know the gardener was a baker, did you?
think I ate of them. I'm not sure if that's what the recipe calls for or not, but I'm gonna have eight scones. Hopefully. Temperature is, you know, really backing off nicely to the point where it's not burning them, but it, you know, it's cooking them. And uh, you know, we want to make sure the center is cooked or whatever. The outside is really looking nice. It's not burned. It's just, you know, nice and firm and charred. I, you know, it may not be turning out the way in a, a normal traditional scone would be in a, in some type of cafe or something, but it's. Uh, it's the Pokey Shack version of blueberry scones. Outdoor cooking, we're out in the garden. A little rainy, cold, dreary, nasty. I don't know. It's outdoor gardening weather. At least outdoor cooking weather. Hey folks, uh, I don't know what step we're on between the multiple steps and multiple days of cured and smoked salmon, the multiple steps and multiple days of pizza dough or bagel dough, pretzel dough, whatever kind of dough you want, or <laughs> scones or fresh uh, harvested Pokey Shack Farms oregano uh, but we're getting there folks we are getting there You 
get your flour from Naples, Italy, you're on your way to doing something good. So there we go. We could make eight, eight Pookie Shack pizzas if we wanted to. We're making bagels. Temperature is, is pretty warm, pretty warm, and it's wood heat, and uh, so you know, up against the fire, it's going to be hot. So, got to get in there and rotate them. All right, well, let's let these bagels cook. Friends, if you like my channel, like it, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. restaurant going on up in here. <laughs> Want another pizza salmon? She said, yeah, buddy. I'm ready for Alaska. Mm -hmm. 